come into my room to find this guy laying there. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? What are you doing? Laying down. Good boy. Yeah, you good boy. We're back. Cleaning out this unit. The TV stand here. Already loaded up. Well, busted up and then loaded up. But we just have this little bit of stuff to pick up. And then we're going to head to the landfill. There's two box springs and three mattresses, I think. That roll of carpet. A mirror back there. That uh, baby mattress. We're going to get this done and get on out of here. And it's all empty now. Storage unit's empty. Got everything loaded up in the truck here. Not too shabby, about a little bit higher than the cab in the front. About the same height as the cab in the back. Believe it or not, it only took me 12 minutes to load this up. I took the first video at 118 or 116 and now it's 128. Well, I've now made it back to my storage unit, as you can see. Um, I had to come over here to pick up some trash bags and some totes. I think I have enough totes, I don't know. As you'll see here in a minute, the $140 unit is pretty junky. So I needed to pick up some stuff, totes and trash bags and stuff so that I could load everything into there to move it in the truck. Don't feel like hauling the trailer up there for it. I'm hoping it'll all fit in one load, but I guess we'll see. This stuff here is pretty cool. Another light mirror, a Playboy picture. There's some signs. A Corona sign, this Bud Light sign, and Budweiser sign. They all came out of that uh, trailer load I was unloading. Some more signs in these pictures and everything, but I like the beer signs, they're cool. And the end result, $73. Damn diesel. Well, this is that other $140 unit that I was talking about a little bit earlier. It's the next day now, and we're about to clean this guy out. There's a TV there, a TV on end. I don't understand why people store TVs like this, but that's how they do it. Saw a little PS2 there, but who knows? I was very curious about this unit because it was just all junky, and I like junky units. So we'll come back to you uh, if we find anything good. And about two hours later, we're done. All cleaned out. Everything's empty. About two hours of rebagging bags and loading stuff into totes. But she's done. And you can see we got the truck all loaded up to about the height of the cab. That's all bags underneath that rug. I got pretty ingenuitive cutting holes in the rugs to run my cords through them. So it would hold the rug down better. Well, time to head to the storage unit and we'll see. Hopefully nothing falls off. So we got it all piled up back here in front of all the stuff. Boxes that were nicely stacked, but here's all the bags and everything. Piled up, ready to be gone through. Some of the totes that didn't have lids and stuff we went through. Haven't really found anything crazy yet, but I guess we'll see. She's packed and full now. <laughs> couple buddies to go see the new uh, Star Wars movie it just came out tonight we went down there and checked that out I really don't know much about Star Wars but it was a pretty good movie yeah that's basically what we did tonight was went and see the Star Wars movie it was fun had a good time and uh, back to work tomorrow from cornhole last night ended up winning the tournament i think i won like 35 bucks so it was pretty fun um we were first place never lost all night that was nice um had a good time last night but now i'm up gotta go do some christmas shopping still have a lot to do let's go shopping 
I feel like they're cutting through the floor. This is kind of scary. Because, as you can see, my house is on fire. Ouch. I live in this pile and they're burning it. It's very hot and I want my mommy. This is Your Chuck mommy Welter is in the fire. Go after checking her. Checking out of the Got fire. Her. Look at that. And all the lights. It's Christmas time. We're back at the crib here. TJ here. What's we got up? storage hunter Corey, man. We're just chilling. We're watching cocaine people. We're not very good at YouTube. I'll be honest with you guys. Um, we don't know what to say. We don't know what to do. Um, so. We're going to delete this video. be honest with you. This isn't good. Um, this is this is this is terrible. <laughs> at the beginning of this video just been going through stuff had the little time lapse going while i was working at the table up there haven't really found anything crazy yet just some dvds series and stuff like that tv shows playstation 1 playstation 2 i know there's another playstation 2 in here somewhere i just gotta find it as you can see back here i've got all the bags still piled up to go through and then that whole corner of stuff from that 40 dollar unit also this 140 dollar unit that i still have to go through so we're just going to keep on pushing through it here's those two playstations here's a little white ps2 and then a PlayStation 1 there. Pulled them out of a bag. And then we've also got a whole bunch of the movies here that you saw me going through in that time lapse. The Andy Griffith Show. Medea. Little House on the Prairie. ER. The Cosby Show. There's a whole bunch of them. We've got those piled up there. And then we've also got this whole tub here that's almost full of just movies. But some of them are cases. Some of them are series that don't have all the discs. And then I've also got a pile right here of just discs did find a few games there's mario 3d world for the wii u some playstation games the incredibles uh, super mario brothers for the wii u and then mario kart for the wii so those are pretty decent they'll sell good online and hopefully find the other games to them but I guess we'll figure out. Just keep on pushing through it. So I just pulled this bag up to the table. Didn't really feel like doing a time lapse so you guys watching me go through clothes. But open this bag up and pull out a freaking part of a gun. Except it's a fake gun. Little airsoft gun. It's broken. That kind of sucks. Wish it was real. So continuing with the same bag where the fake gun came out of, just opened up this part here and found the Wii U that I suppose those games were played on. But it's actually pretty clean. Hopefully I'll find the cords to it and the little tablet that goes with it. Alright, well I got the truck full of trash there. Also got a whole bunch of trash right there. A few totes. And then also a couple right there. I'm heading home. I'm tired. I think it's about 7.30 or something right around there. I'm hungry. I've barely eaten today. So I'm going to head on home, get some food. I'll catch you guys a little later. I know you guys saw some of the video game stuff that I was pulling out of them bags yesterday. Here's some stuff that I actually have listed on eBay. All these here and all these here, well, to that golf one, are all um, original NES games, which are really cool. These ones, I actually had two rows at one point of all the ones that are in the boxes. And it's kind of difficult to find the ones in the boxes, uh, considering back in the day they would just take the game out of the box and just throw them away. But then you've also got these ones that are just the normal carts, which is how you normally find them. 
And I've also got all these video games over here. It's pretty cool. Well, it's the next morning. I'm not feeling too good today. I don't know why. I don't have my tripod. Just realized a little bit ago that I left it in Peyton's car last night. I went with him to Walmart and left it there. But we're going to do some editing today. Might do a little eBay listing. Not really sure. Just going to hang around the house. Like I said, I'm not really feeling good. Took some medicine. Might take a nap. Not sure yet. Just got some medicine for this little cold that I'm having. Got some uh, nasal spray. Some cold relief medicine and some decongestant. Not feeling the best right now, so hopefully some of this will work. Well, I got my medicine, took some, took a little nap. I still feel like hell. So I think I'm gonna go to sleep. It's about 10.30. Hopefully I'll feel better tomorrow, but I guess we'll see. Really didn't do much today at all. What are you going to do? <laughs>